Hello, hello. Hello, Rosa. Hi, Rosa. How are you? Hi, I'm fine. It's a pleasure to have you here. <clears throat> well, your friends are going to connect in a second. We are going to start another day of classes. How was your day today? ¿Qué tal su día, el día de hoy? ¿Cómo le fue? Um, muy bien. Cansada. It was tired, right? Cansada, sí. In that mm -hmm. case, you say it was tiring. Tiring. It's like, ah, uh, tiring. <laughs> Fue agotador, right? It was tiring. Tiring. Very good. Hello, Noel. How are you? Hi, teacher. I'm so bad. Really? What happened? I have a problem in the university. Oh, really? Uh, what happened yeah. at the university? But I uh, no quieren tomar en cuenta un servicio social. Solo eso. Yeah, hopefully they are going to work on that one, right? Yeah, it's a difficult thing, but maybe, yeah, present all the documents that are necessary and it's going to be done. Okay, hello, Eric, how are you? Good evening, teacher. I doing good. How was good. your day? Uh, nice. Nice. My day was nice. Very good. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you for asking. I yep. am doing good. I am doing good. Very happy to see you. Very happy to be here in class again. Hello, Brenda. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you. Excellent. Thank you for asking me. Excellent. Welcome to the class. Hello, Veronica. How are you? I'm fine, teacher. I am very glad to see you. Well, to listen to you because I cannot see you. Ana Beatriz, how are you? Hello, good evening. Good evening, welcome to the class. Mr. Gustavo Adolfo, how are you today? Hello, teacher, good evening. I'm good evening. I'm fine and I'm very busy with tasks. I imagine, right, you are very busy. Okay, yes, welcome to another class. Welcome to another opportunity to continue learning. Remember that uh, we don't have classes tomorrow. We have classes on Monday, okay? Don't, uh, it happens like on Friday, teacher Nati, where are you? I am here. No, Fridays are free for you to go on vacation, for you to enjoy, for you to go for some pupusas, right? Fridays are your day off for you to enjoy with your family. Okay, what were we studying yesterday? Es el momento de que saquen el cuaderno todo lo que anotaron ayer y me digan qué estudiamos ayer. What did we study yesterday? Possessive adjectives. Possessive adjectives. Good. What else? We studied possessive adjectives. What else? Subjects. What else? Presentation. Right, how to introduce yourself, right? How to introduce yourself, introductions, that's very good. Can you give me examples of possessive adjectives? Give me examples of possessive adjectives. My, my your, 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 your it's all day. Very good. Can you give me one example sentence with a possessive adjective? My name is Wendy. Wendy, I cannot listen to you. <laughs> I, I read your lips. <laughs> well, thanks. <laughs> okay, good. Very good. My name is Wendy, name is you Wendy. say. Another example. Hello, Claudita. Claudita Sarabia, how are you? Hello, teacher. Hi. 
Y dije, Ay. Y Claudita, a esta señora la conozco. Ah. Yes, it's me. It's me. Hello, it's me. Yes. Okay, good. Eric Cardoza, give me one example of a sentence with a possessive adjective. Your car is red. Your car is red. Very good. Mr. René Varillas. Good night. Hi. Hi. Good evening. Give me one example of a sentence with a possessive adjective. This laptop is mine. Very good. This laptop is mine. Excellent. Hey, you have a new hairstyle today. Yes, because I <laughs> I need a cut. <laughs> yeah, but that, that that looks good, right? That yes, thank good. you. Thank you, Miss. Yeah, you see. Yeah, los chicos casi siempre bien raro que alguien les note, pero yo, yo siempre les noto cuando traen algo nuevo aquí al salón. Así que. Okay, nice. Ya ven, los tengo vigiados a todos. <laughs> That's good. Let me see. Adela. Hello, Adela. Give me one example sentence with a possessive adjective. Oh, teacher. Give me one example, like my name is Adela, your name is Natalie, his name is Juanito. Give me one example. Un ejemplo. My name, uh -huh. my name is Adela. My name is Adela, very good. Rosa Amaya, give me one example sentence with a possessive adjective. Um, eh, your, your beautiful. You're beautiful. Thank you. I know. <laughs> Thank you. No, <laughs> okay. Okay. Your your friend, it's beautiful, right? Your teacher is beautiful. Thank you very much. <laughs> your classmates are handsome. Your classmates are beautiful, right? And that's the way we use the your form as a possessive adjective. Well, thank you very much for the introduction of the class. Very nice. So we're going to move forward. Yesterday we did this exercise in the class, right? We did this last exercise yesterday. Do you remember it? Right? And we were complementing the exercise with specific forms of the sentences. Creo que este fue el último que hicimos el día de ayer. And we say, eh, their names are Noriko. We are students. The answer was our. The next one was your. The next answer was he. The next one was my. The next one was her. This was they. And the last one is it. Right? This is what we did yesterday. Right now we're going to have a little pronunciation exercise. And all of you are going to have the opportunity to read one of the sentences until it gets the correct pronunciation, okay? Las vamos a ir leyendo todas hasta que tengamos la pronunciación correcta y ahí pasamos a la siguiente persona. We are going to go first with Rosa Amaya. Can you read the first sentence? Um, they, they are my, my classmates. Their names are no, Noriko and Kate. Okay, they are my classmates. Their names are Noriko and Kate. They are my classmates. Their names are Noriko and Kate. They, Repeat. They, they they are Noriko and Kate. Okay, they are my classmates. They are my classmates. Their names are Noriko and Kate. They are names. Are Noriko and Kate. They are my classmates. Their names are Noriko and Kate. They are my classmates. Their names are Noriko and Kate. Okay, Rosa, continue <laughs> practicing. Ya vuelvo, ya vuelvo con Rosa. Sígala practicando. Wendy Ramirez, number two. Where students or classroom number is uh, 108C. We are students. Our classroom number is 108C. We are students. La, our classroom number it is 108C. Again? We are students. Our classroom number 
is 108C. Very good. Rene, number three. Uh, excuse me. What's your last name again? Very good. Excuse me. What's your last name again? Because you are asking the question. That was very good. Adela, number four. That's my um, Mr. King is in my class. Okay. He is my class. Okay. That's Mr. Kim. He is in my class. Mr. King, he is my class. That's he Mr. Is Kim. In my class. He is <laughs> in my class. Very good. Again. Leamolo de nuevo, Adela. Okay. That's that's Mr. King. He is in my class. Very good. Number five, Eric. Uh, my name is Elizabeth. Please call me Liz. Very good. Brenda, number six. This is Paul's wife. Her name is Jennifer. Very good. Number seven, Claudia Sarabia. I am from Venice, Italy. Is a it 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 is a beautiful city. I am from Venice, Italy. It is a beautiful city. I'm from Venice, it, Italy. Italy. It is a beautiful city. Right from Venice, Venice. Italy. It is a beautiful city. Ana Beatriz, number seven. My parents are on vacation. They are in South Korea. My parents are on vacation. They are in South Korea. Again, my parents. Uh -huh. My parents are on vacation. Are in South Korea. They are in South Korea. Noel, number one. They are my classmates. Their names are Noriko and Kay. Very good. Veronica, number two. Where a student's classroom number is. Okay, we are students. Or a classroom yeah. number is 108C. We are a student's classroom number is. 108C. A, C. 108C. We are students. Our classroom number is 108C. Okay. We're a student classroom number is, is. 108C. <laughs> okay. Continue practicing. Continue practicing. Gustavo Adolfo, number three. Excuse, excuse me, what's your last name again? Very good. Christian, number four. That's Mr. King. He is in my class. Very good. Ernesto, number five. My name is Elizabeth. Please call me Liz. Very good. Rosa, number one. They're my classmates. Their names are Noriko and Kate. Their names are Noriko and Kate. Very good job. Thank you very much for this. What is the problem in some cases when we are practicing pronunciation? Confidence. Confidence is a big problem for pronunciation. Que a veces nos da pena y decimos, quizás no me va a salir bien. Mejor la voy a leer por pedacitos. No, try to read it complete. Right, try to read the sentences complete, and it is going to be a very good opportunity for you to practice pronunciation. Hasta donde encontremos la primer punto, o hasta que encontremos la primera puntuación, hasta ahí nos detenemos. They are my classmates. Their names are Noriko and Kate. Right, you cannot say they are my classmates. So it has to be one sentence. We are going to practice pronunciation a lot during this module. So that's why I was focusing on this one. Check on the examples that we have here, and I need you to create one original example based on this one. Usando estos que tenemos aquí como ejemplo, cambiemos la información y hagamos uno original. 
con información nuestra. I need one sentence. Based on this one. We can say, they are my friends. Their names are Juanito and Paquito. And we have another sentence, right? I need you to create one sentence. Entry volunteers to share them. Uh -huh. New sentences. Who can give me examples? My name is Crisia. Her name is Natalie. Very good. Very good. Another example. They're my parents. Their names are Herman and Roxana. Excellent. Very good. More examples. One more. One more. <laughs> yes, Mr. Eric, your example. Be like this. I'm thinking. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking. Yeah, okay, you're thinking. Uh, Claudia, what is your example? They're my friends. Their name are Marlene and Adela. Very good. Very good examples. Right, very good examples. One more. I am, I, I am from San Miguel, El Salvador. Uh -huh. It's a beautiful city. Excellent example, right? You can see as just by changing a couple of things, we can create more new examples. That was very good. Thank you very much. Okay, you created your own examples. Now, here I have a little exercise and I need you to choose the most appropriate answer for this. Right? I am from Medellin, Colombia. It's a beautiful city, says Gustavo in the chat. That's very good. So if I have the sentence, hi, I am Liz, what do you think the best option is in this case? It's, oh, hi. You cannot say, what do people call you? Porque no le podemos decir, ¿y cómo le, cómo le dicen? ¿Cómo se llama? Si ya nos está diciendo en la primera oración, hi, I am Liz. Okay, it would be like, Liz. <laughs> My name is Jim Holmes. What do you think is the most appropriate answer? Nice to meet you, Mr. Holmes. Nice to meet you, Mr. Holmes. ¿Por qué Mr. Holmes y no Mr. Jim? Because it's the last name. Because you use the last name. Very good. For the titles, right? Cuando ocupamos los titles, the ones that we have here, Mr. or Miss, for a lady or Mrs., you use the last name. For a lady, you use Mrs. Right? Cuando es una señora casada, Mrs. Or Miss, si es una señorita. And the last name is going to be accompanying that. Okay? The next one we have. This is Jenny Parker. What is the most appropriate answer? Hello, Mr. Jenny Parker. Okay, it says, uh -huh. this yes, is Jenny one. Parker. One. Hello, Miss Jenny Parker. Hello, Miss Jenny Parker. It can be possible, but it says like, si te están presentando a alguien, decimos, hey, this is Juanito Perez. Oh, nice to meet you, Juanito Perez. Okay. Right? Nice to meet you, Mrs. Parker. That would be the correct answer. Okay. Hello, I am William Dean. Please call me Bill. What would be the most appropriate answer here? I am William Pleased Dim. Pleased to meet you, Bill. Pleased to meet you, Bill. Very good. Pleased to meet you, Bill. Porque el mismo le está diciendo, please call me Bill. So, please to meet you, Bill. Please to meet you, Mr. Dean. He'll be like, yeah, I just mentioned. <laughs> Excuse me, what's your name again? Joe Kim. Joe Kim. Joe Kim. Very good. How do you spell your first name? C H A R L E L N M E. Very good. C H A R L E N E. Very good. Let me see. Um Mr. Rene, what is your other name? Can you spell it please? My other name, my second name? Yes. Spell uh, it. Yes. Is Vladimir B L A D I M I R. Very good. 
Adela, what is your other name? Can you spell it? What is your other name? I am in. I? S. I N E S. Ines. Yes. Very good. Very good. Let me see. Veronica, what is your other name? Um, is um, B E R O B E R R O O um, M yeah. I I <laughs> C A. Okay, you spelled Veronica, but that was correct. That was good, right? Veronica, Veronica. <laughs> so you have your uh, your name, right? That's very good. That's the way you use it when you say, "How do you spell your first name?" Because in some cases we have a lot of problems on the spelling, right? Imagine in my case, it was like, "What's your name, Natalie?" Ah, uh -huh, with th, with ly, with y, with it's like you have a lot of forms, right? It's like no, Natalie, just like that. Ah, oh, okay, okay, they say. Here I have a little exercise, and for this one we are going to use the chat. But I esto vamos a ocupar el chat, and I need you to send me on the chat the number of the answer and the number of the question. Sorry, the number of the sentence and the answer. For example, I can send you the zero and the answer for the sentence, okay? I need you to check on the different sentences, give me the number of the sentence and the answer that is missing, okay? Go ahead, everybody to the chat right now. I need you to send me the answers. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Very good, Noel, very good. René, very good, Brenda, excellent. Continue sending me the answers on the chat. There you go, I am receiving more answers. Number four, M, um, very good. Very good, number seven is, very nice. Number six, R, very nice, very nice. Number six, seven, very good. Send me the answers, send me the answers. Very good, Noel, very nice. Very good. Number 10 is very good. Number eight, there. Number 11, R. Very good, very good. Now I need 11 volunteers to raise their hand and give me the answers on the microphone. I need 11 volunteers. Eric is the first one. Number zero. Number zero is is <laughs> but i need you to read the complete sentence ah okay okay my teacher is american my teacher is american good hey and the other volunteers ¿Qué pasó con todos los demás volunteers? where are the hands up very good christian number two well number one we are at school we are at school very good the next one volunteers noel Number... Where is my dictionary? Where is my dictionary? Very good. Let's continue. More volunteers. Si no seguimos con la lista. Rene Varias, number three. Uh, what's it? it? What, what's it, it? What yes. is it? Is what it? is it? Right? What yes. is it? Very what good. Is it? What is it? Like, ¿qué es eso? What is it? What is it? Very good. Ana Beatriz, number four. I am 11 years old. Number five, Gustavo. Are you okay? 
Very good. Number six, Adela. We are students. We are a students. Number seven, Ana, sorry, Brenda Rivera. Brendita, number seven. What do you want? Number seven. Monroy is my brother. Very good. Claudia Sarabia, number eight. Susan and Sarah um, are very good. Are my friends. My, are friends. my friends. Very good. Let me see. Ernesto Masariego, number nine. I am from Spain. I am from Spain. Very good. The next one, it's going to be for Veronica, number 10. They is friends. They is friends. Con they ocupamos is or are, si es plural. Are. They are, are friends. Are. And what about number 10? Who can help me with number 10? So you say John. Is, ¿Qué ocuparíamos en número 10? Yeah, John is English. English. What is the meaning of English in this sentence? ¿A qué se refiere English in this sentence? Nationality. It's a nationality, right? It's the nationality of John. John is English. That it's very, very, very good. John is English, okay? So I am going to go to the next part here. Okay, so here we have, let me just move a little bit here, move it up and here we go. We are going to go now, right? We have studied the sentences in the normal form, the sentences with the normal subjects, the sentences with possessives. Now we are going to use WH questions for personal information. In the WH questions, we have a specific examples, okay? ¿Qué tipo de preguntas tenemos presentadas ahí? What, where, how, who, and when. What, in what cases do you use what when you are asking for information about something? Examples, what is your name? What is your age, right? In which cases do you use where? Here you have the information. In what cases for do you use place. Where? When you are asking for a place, what are the examples that I have? Where is El Salvador? Salvador? Where is El Salvador? Where and right now. where are you right now? Right right now? Right now. Uh -huh. If I ask you the question, where is El Salvador, people? In Central America. Central America. In Central America. Where are you right now? In my house. Class. In my class. I said like, in my house. <laughs> I am in my house, teacher. Okay. In which place of the house are you right now? Where are you in your house? In the room. In the living room. Good. In the living room, in the restroom, in the, in the bedroom, right? In the bathroom, in the bathroom. depending, <laughs> right? It's depending. A job, it's a job, it's a job. <laughs> It's like, I am in the bathroom. Okay, el último, que, el último que enciende la cámara me explica la clase. <laughs> gracias, primero Dios, gracias. No creeré en eso. <laughs> el último que enciende la cámara explica la clase. <laughs> no, you say, I am in the restroom, you say. No, yeah. Yeah, I, I, I had a student who received the class in the garage. Because he had three kids. Wow. That's why. Yeah. Because, yeah, I always thought he was an, a taxi driver. And I said, like, usted trabaja de, 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 como de, de driver or something? He's like, no, teacher. I am in the garage. And I said, like, why? Because I have three kids, teacher. <laughs> and they were little. They were like, papa, 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 and Sima all the time. So it was difficult. So where are you right now? In the living room, in the bedroom, in the kitchen, right? Well, depending, in the kitchen is not possible porque ahí encima de la estufa no creo que nadie esté recibiendo la clase. You can be in the dining room, en la mesa del comedor, in the dining room. Okay, the next one is how. In which cases do you use how? 
asking for a manner or a way, right? How? How do you do it? How are you? Como la primera pregunta que les hago siempre que entro a clases. How are you today? How was your day? Right? How are your classes? Como son tus clases? Right? Who? When you use who? When you are asking for a person. Right? Who? Who is she? Who is the girl in black? Who is the girl behind you? Who is the little kid next to you? Uh-huh. I will say like, ajá, uh -huh. y esa niña que está ahí a la par de, de su cámara, ¿quién es? Y yo diré, ¡ah! <laughs> Padre nuestro. That would, be, that would be very, very like, okay. It's like, who's she? My wife, you say. <laughs> who's, she, who's he? My husband. And your husband behind the classes there, checking if you are studying. Yo no sé con quién está chateando. No, that's teacher Nati. I was like, ah, okay. I believe it. Who? That's the Mr. use of who? Yes? Excuse me. I have to get up for a minute, please. Don't worry. Don't worry. Go ahead. Go ahead. Don't worry. Si alguien ah, enciende la cámara de Adela, ahí salimos corriendo todos. Teacher, I yes? have a question. Question me. What's the mean manner or manner manner manera oh, okay okay Thank you. because i say like how are you you are going to tell me the way you are right i am fine i am good i am marvelous excellent fantastic right that's a manner de qué manera te encuentras so that is asking for a manner and the last one when you say when you are asking for a specific time or a specific date when is your birthday when is the class so, if I ask you the question, what is your name? What is the answer that you can give me? Everybody, go ahead. You can give me answers. What is your name? ¿Cuál sería la respuesta para eso? What is your name? My name, My is, name, is, name is Wendy. Very good. What is your age? My I age. am I 20 years one old. Years old. 26. I am 26. <laughs> I am 15, 15. Good. <laughs> uh, the I next one. 18 years yeah, old. 18 years old. 18, yeah. 19. Eric, you are 18 years old. Yep. Hey. It's, a, it's a baby. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty awesome. That's pretty awesome. I remember when I was 18. <laughs> okay, yeah, a lot. Yeah, it was like, no, the dinosaurs, come on. Yeah, <laughs> solo porque tenía uno de mascota. Come on, the dinosaurs. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Pero ahí estuve, ahí estuve, y aquí ya vas a estar. <laughs> yeah, no, no, enjoy, 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 enjoy your days, enjoy your, your, your experience, your life, everything, enjoy it. Disfrute cada uno de los años. Que de ahí a la espalda, que no sé qué, las rodillas. Y tal. No, 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 no. Enjoy, enjoy. Enjoy. It. Yes, definitely. The next one we have who? Who is the youngest person in the class? Who is the youngest person in the class? It's Eric. Eric. It's Eric, 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 Eric. right? Eric. It's Eric. <laughs> Who is the lady with the black headset? Wendy. 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 It's Wendy, right? Who is the lady with the yellow poster behind her? Adela. It's Adela. <laughs> Who is the boy with the backpack? Rene. Rene. It's Rene. a backpack or it's a guitar? The guitar. It's yes. a guitar, right? Mm -hmm. yes. Yeah, because it, it was familiar for me. Who is Amen. the lady with the light blue blouse? Yes. Light you. blue blouse. You. No, yeah. mine is oh, blue. Is blue. Mine is blue. What is? It? Who is the lady with the light yeah. blue blouse? Hey, no quito la cámara. Yeah. Brendita. <laughs> She's the lady with the light blue blouse. Right? Yes. Con la camisa celeste. 
Who is the lady with the black blouse? Ana Beatriz. Ana Beatriz, right? Who is the lady in the white blouse? Rosa. Rosa, right? So that is the way we use who, right? When you say who, who's she? And the last question, when is your birthday? When is your birthday? No, November 5th. Okay, Crisia, November 6th, you say. No, 5th. 5th? 15. Ah, 15. 15. 15. 15. Mm -hmm. I said, like, tomorrow. I said, November 5th. <laughs> Me, tomorrow. Oh, Wendy, oh, your yeah. birthday oh. is tomorrow. Happy oh, birthday, birthday to you. Birthday. Happy birthday to Thank you. Thank you. But not 18. <laughs> no, for, no, you will be forever, forever 21. <laughs> Congratulations, Wendy, on your birthday you. tomorrow. I am going to give you vacation just for that. Yes, thank you. Yeah, Gustavo sent you a cake. You see, that was pretty awesome. Who's, uh, whose birthday is in November 2? Okay, we have Wendy that is in November. Who else is in November? November 5th. November 5th. 5th. Alguien más de noviembre? No? December? Rene, December what? And Ana Beatriz, good. December 24. 24, Christmas 24. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> Merry it, Christmas. It, it, it's a nice because- No, no. only because one, one, only one, one gift. gift. <laughs> only one <laughs> gift. Yes. They say like, okay, Merry no. Christmas and happy birthday. It's like, <laughs> sí. yeah. That's a bad joke. Yeah. Yeah. that is like, here you have a pan con chum, so huh? like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Salud. Same, same food. Definitely. Yes. One yeah. Gift. Wendy. Yeah. Está only, ahí. only tamales. <laughs> only tamales and recalentado <laughs> for for your birthday. Your cake. Okay. Your cake will tamales. Yeah. No. Yes. And the cake. The cake is the same cake for Christmas. <laughs> Not turkey. <laughs> that birthday. Turkey. No, it's a cumbiones. Yeah, but <laughs> will you have cumbiones for your birthday? That's pretty awesome. That is, that is really good. <laughs> okay, Ana Beatriz, when is your birthday in December? 17. 17, right? 17, good. Someone from January? No, February? February 5. Me. February 5. Adela, good. Eric? 24. February 24. Yeah, almost. Yeah, yeah. You, you were not yeah. Valentine's. Claudia? In July 15. July 15. Excellent. Nice. July. Uh, someone from March? No? April? Yeah. Noel? April yes. what? 13. 13. Good. Very good. May? Algún materno aquí? May? June. Oh, we have it. July, August. No, September. July. July. September. Veronica. Veronica. Sorry. Brenda in September. In September nine. September nine. Good. Well, I my birthday. When is your birthday? How about you? September fifteen. Okay. I remember. I remember. I was. I was with you on my birthday. I remember. Yes. yes. I remember a... your fear life. Oh yeah. Yes. Yeah. September 15. I am very independent. Yeah. A una compañera le ponemos el himno nacional. También a Nati se lo pusimos. Yeah. Yo estaba con ellos justo, justo en el en la fecha de mi cumpleaños les di clases a ellos. Yeah. Pero les di vacación, les di día Ajá. libre, no <laughs> yeah. hey, hey, it is it is a very it's like René, it, it's not funny because people don't remember, people remember independence. And <laughs> and it's like, hey, today's independence, vacation and everything. And I'm like Every party celebration brings day. Uh -huh. all the country. There was like chan cha chan 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 uh -huh. so it's it's not it's not that that okay, but in the end, it's very nice because I always have vacation. So that's the questions with WH. I have here some other examples. 
with the questions with B. What's your name? Where is your friend? Who is son, he? What are your classmates like? Where are you and Lisa from? And how are your classes? The answers for these ones. What's your name? My name is Beth. Where is your friend? Donde esta? He is in class. Whose son he? She is my classmate. What are your classmates like? They are very nice. Where are you and Luisa from? We are from Brazil. How are your classes? They are really interesting. I need you please to write an answer for the questions using your information. Go ahead. All the questions, teacher. Yes, please. Okay. I take a picture. You can take a picture of it or you can just answer it like that. Ahí lo pueden ir viendo y lo pueden ir contestando. It's not necessary that you take a picture or that you copy everything. I need only the answers. In question number three, for example, where it says, whose son he, you can say, who is Noel, who is René, who is Nati, and you can answer the question. What are your classmates like? Where are you and your family from? Right? How are your classes? And you can write the answers. I am going to give you a couple of minutes for you to finish. And then all of you are going to give me the answers of this week. Okay, so what is the answer for the first one? What is your name? What is the answer for the first one? Uh, my name's Rene. My name is Rene, very good. Sorry, I have a visitor right here. Hey, the next one, where is your friend right now? What is your best friend right now? Where do you think your best friend is right now? My work. At work, right? He's at work or she's at work, right? Very good. Who is Natalie de Flores? She's my teacher. He's my teacher, right? He's, He's my kid. My English teacher. He's my English teacher, right? And the next one, what are your classmates like? They are very nice. They are very nice. They are very intelligent. They are very interesting. And where are you and your family from? We are from El Salvador, right? We are from El Salvador. We are from Russia. You say we're from Canada. Morocco. We're from Morocco. Morocco. <laughs> from Morocco, okay. Brazil. Yes. That's very good. Excellent. <laughs> How are your classes like? They are, really they, uh, they are very good, you say. Very they, are, nice. they are very, very, nice. really very chilly. <laughs> very chilly. <laughs> That's very nice because you are learning right. That's pretty awesome. The next one. Let me see. Let's see me. <laughs> 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 yeah, you see. 
<laughs> introduced for us. Yeah, <laughs> no, he was just getting things and he was leaving, right? <laughs> yeah, he, he was just taking the cars from, from my class and he was escaping. Yeah, he takes advantage that I am busy, right? <laughs> no, he's he's a, a little creature. Okay, <laughs> good. Repeat, please repeat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's a little creature. It's like me llevo las cartas se las enseño a papá y flum. He was not here anymore. He was with the cards running away. So, in the use of the WH questions, we have to be very careful at the moment of answering because here you have the information in the answer and it's going to give you an idea of what you need in the question. So, in this case, we have Oh, that Mrs. West. In the question, you need who, because you are looking for a person. If you have this one here, she's from Miami, and we have she from. Where? What do you think you need on the question? Where, Where is she from? from? Where, Where is she from? from? Right? Where right. is she mm -hmm. from? Because on mm -hmm. the answer, you have a country, right? You have a place, right? In this case, you have a city. Her first name, it's Celia. What? What? What, is, what, is, what, is, what is what is her, name. her, her, what is her first, first name? name? It's Celia. The next one we have here, the two students over there, their names are Jeremy and Karen. Oh. Their names are Jeremy and Karen. What do you Where think we need on the question? Who are? Who are, right? Because you need you are looking for a person and in the answer you have you have an answer okay the next one we have they are from vancouver canada where where are you are, from they where are, are they are. from where are they from right <laughs> where are they from they are from vancouver canada on the answer you have a specific location right and in the last one, we have a description. They are shy, but very friendly. How? What? How? What? How? How? Because you are describing a person, mm -hmm. describing the manner of the person. How are? How are they like? They are shy, but very friendly. Mm -hmm. They are shy, but very friendly. If I ask you, how are Salvadorians like? Si alguien les preguntara de otro país, how are Salvadorians like? Very friendly. They are very friendly. Yes. Well, um, depend, depend. Depending, right? Depending. <laughs> depending on the time of the day, right? <laughs> si son las cinco de la mañana, the they are sun, like. Here, yeah. If you are hungry or not. <laughs> depending. After traffic. Depends. Yes. After traffic, right? If you are at the traffic, Maybe you are Bang. not very friendly, right? The the mood can be before pupusas and after pupusas. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah. Before coffee or after coffee. Yeah, yeah. It changes. It changes the mood, right? It changes the it's mood. That when I... Definitely. Problemas que no le pasan a Eric. Porque todavía está joven. Yeah. Yeah. Eric todavía no sabe qué es el before coffee and el after coffee. Ah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like coffee. You don't like coffee? Oh, yeah. hey. Really? Oh, I'm, leaving. Leaving. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. <laughs> hey, hey. Uh, you, you don't like coffee? But, but that's good. No you do divino tesoro, hijo. Yeah. Uh, you, you don't like coffee? But what do you drink? Esperante que trabaje. Sí. I drink juice. Oh, you drink juice. But that's yeah. good. It's healthy. healthy it's boy. healthy. It's a very healthy boy. It is good. Continue drinking sometimes, juice. Now. Sometimes now. Now it's healthy. Now it's healthy. Ay, ya te la taste. No tomas café. <laughs> tomorrow, tomorrow is Friday. Tomorrow, not, not drink juice. Ah. Only coffee. <laughs> that's we went good. happy hour. Minimum. <laughs> no. <laughs> I hate the coffee. You don't you hate the coffee. Well, Amen. yeah. I have a friend. I have a friend that it's the only friend that I know. Well, now I know too with you that they hate coffee. Yeah, but teacher, I I will because I like the the cold coffee. 
Ah, so mm. you see, you don't like the hot coffee. Yeah. Ah, that's hot. another level. It's hot. It's okay, it's okay. Ya, ya te recibimos aquí en el club. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. <laughs> that's good, that's good. That's very nice. Okay, ya te recibimos aquí en el club de los cafeteros. That's very uh, yeah. nice. Yeah, ya sea al lado see, caliente. I can okay. see that. <laughs> yeah, it's a matter of, of, of age, I think. Yeah, but I enjoy juice. I like tea. I like milk. But I mean, wow. nothing beats coffee, definitely. But yes. coffee is, like is the favorite. So answer the questions. Answer the questions. Who's that? Oh, that's my. Oh, that's oh, Miss West. West. Where is she from? She's, She's from, from Miami. Miami. What is her first name? It's Celia. Yeah. Who are the two students over there? Their names are Jeremy and Karen. Karen. Where are they from? They're from, They're from Vancouver, 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 Canada. How are they like? They're, They're shy, 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 but very, very friendly. friendly. They are shy, but very friendly. Very good job. The next one. <clears throat> we are going to work on uh, this mini conversation that I have here. And in this one, we're going to include many of the questions that we have been studying. And um, listen to the conversation first, and then you are going to help me to read it, okay? Listen to it. And it says, hey, David, how is it going? Fine, thanks. How are you? Pretty good. So are your classes interesting this semester? Yes, they are. I really love chemistry. Chemistry? chemistry. Are you and Beth in the same class? No, we aren't. My class is in the morning. Her class is in the afternoon. Listen, I am on my way to the cafeteria now. Are you free? Sure. Let's go. New words, new vocabulary. Palabras nuevas, vocabulario nuevo. No? She missed. Chemistry or she mystery? Chemistry. Chemistry. Chemistry is chemica. Chemica. Oh. Any other question? New words or new vocabulary? Teacher is cafeteria or uh, cafeteria. What is the cafeteria. 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 Yes. Cafeteria. Cafeteria. This is a cognate because it's the same in English and in Spanish, but the pronunciation is different. So, any other one? No? Okay. So, mm -hmm. I am going to be Sanhi, and all of you are David. Okay. Todos somos David. Even if it sounds crazy a little bit, but it's good. Hey, David, how is it going? Fine, Fine thanks. thanks. How, how are you? you? How, are how are you? Pretty good. So, are your classes interesting this semester? Yes. Yes, yes. yes. they yes. are. Really like really like chemistry. 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 Are you and Beth in the same class? No, no we, we are. are. We are in class my class in the morning. 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 Yeah. Class is in the afternoon. Yeah. In the afternoon. Yeah. Yeah. Listen, I am on my way to the cafeteria now. Are you free? Sure. 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 Let's go. Okay, now you are Sunhi and I am David. Go ahead. Hey, hey David. 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 How is it going? How is it going? Fine, thanks. How are you? Free. Pretty good. So are you? Interesting. Yes, they are. I really love chemistry. Chemistry? chemistry? Are you in the class? No, we aren't. My class is in the morning. Her class is in the afternoon. Listen. Listen. Oh my, my yeah. way to the are you free? Are you free? Are you free? Are you free? Sure. Let's go. Excellent. So, the yes, no questions. When you make, here we were studying WH questions, right? Estábamos buscando WH questions. Las WH questions son las que nos dan extra information. But the yes, no questions, they only have two options. Yes and no. Are you happy? Yes. Yes. yes but if I say, why are you happy? Because I am in the English class with teacher Nati, because I am learning, because I am with my friends, because that is extra information, right? But the yes, no questions only have one option or two. Yes or no. Are you free right now? 
Yes, I am. Yes, no, I, yes, I am. No, I'm not. No, no, I am not because you are in classes. You are not free. Yes. Okay. Si ahorita me lo llegan a buscar para que vayan a lavar los trastes, les digo, mm -mm. <laughs> no, not right now. In five minutes, I say. <laughs> but not right now. In five minutes. And in five minutes, sigo en clases, que ahorita ya viene la teacher. <laughs> because you don't want to do it. All right? Are you free? No, I am not. Right? I'm not. <laughs> is, is Claudia from Mexico? No, she's no. not. No, she's, she's not. not. She's right? Not. Is Claudia from El Salvador? Yes, she yes, is. Yes, she, yes, is. she, she is. is. Very good. Is your class in the morning? Oh, no, it no. is not. No, it is it's not. not Are you yes. and Brenda in the same class? Yes, yes, we are. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Are your classes interesting? Yes, they yes, are. They are. Yes, they yeah. are. Right? Are you in El Salvador? Yes, yes I, am. I am. We are. Yes, I am. Right? Yes, I am. Or in this case, as you are answering, answering for everybody, yes, we are. Right? Yes, we are. The next one we have uh, is. Let me see. Is Rosa in your class? Yes, she is. Yes, she is, right? Are you an English student? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Yes, yes I am, right? Yes, I am. The difference between the WH questions that we have here and the yes, no questions is that in these ones, we get extra information. And in these ones, we limit ourselves to say, yes, I am. No, I am not. You have to be very careful on the type of questions you are using because Teacher, yes when you say sorry 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 can you uh, can you open the microphone again justo en el momento que silencié los micrófonos yeah. Go ahead. Uh -huh. yeah so when you say a short answer is impolite it is kind of impolite i always i always go for the complete answers even with the contractions, okay? I am not a fan of a lot of contractions because it sounds informal. So I will go for a complete answer. Yes, I am. No, I am not. Yes, she is. Because it sounds a little bit better, right? Yes, I am. No, I am not. Yes, we are. It is good and it's possible and you can use it, right? No está como escrito de que no las puedes ocupar, pero yo preferiría ocupar the complete answers, right? But if you have an option that you need to write the contractions or the short forms, you can do it. Or if you want to answer in a very quick way, it's like, no, I'm not. Yes, no, he's not. No, we're not, right? Yes, we are. No, we are not. It is August. depends on you, right? So I uh, will go, uh-huh. For example, if, they, if he, I want to, to speak, like a native, what is the, the best form? Contract. If you want, well, if you want to speak like a native, uh, like a native English speaker, you will go for the contractions, like okay. in El Salvador, like in El Salvador, so like, no, me es que vamos, no llegue, miren que no soy el... because we speak very fast, right? Okay. And they do it as well. But in many of the cases, when we want to speak faster, we get a little bit confused. So it's better okay. if you go nice, correct, Relax. and straight. Right? It is good. If you if the message is correct, then the answer is either in the contraction, in the normal form, and you can speak the way you want. But let's make it clear. Asegúrense que suene claro y preciso. Right? The way you want to do it, it's the, the preferred one. It's okay. So if I say, are you a student? Yes, I am or no, I am not, right? Or no, I'm not. In this case, yes, you are. Are you from El Salvador? Yes, I am. No, I am not. Is he from El Salvador? Yes, he is. No, he is not, right? In many of the cases, the yes, uh, the affirmative answers are not contracted, okay? The ones that are contracted are the negative ones, okay? You cannot say yes, am. Yes, he's. Yes, it's. Okay. 
las afirmativas nunca van contractadas en este caso, sino que las que contractamos son las negativas. Ok, so you say, yes, he is. You say, yes, he is. Complete form. You don't say, yes, he is. Okay? <laughs> It's not correct. The negative ones are the ones that you can contract. Okay, so in this case, we are going to, um, well, this is the last part that we're going to do today. I just have a couple of examples and we're going to finish the class with these ones. The forms of the verb to be are, is, and am. Are is for we, you, and they. If you have a specific subject in plural, is is for he, she, or it, or you can use my mother, my sister, my father, if you refer to a second person, right? And am is for I. You say, we are friends. You are students. They are from San Marcos, right? Uh, Mary and John are married. Or if you are making a question, are we friends? Are you students? Are they from San Marcos? Thank you. <laughs> yes, for us. Okay, thank you. <laughs> he loves to speak. Okay, so you have, it's he, your father? Is she, your mother? Is it your dog? Right, that's the form of the question. Am I in class? Yes, you are. So please, for the next class on Monday, I need you to bring examples of questions with yes or no, okay? Create at least seven or eight questions using yes or no. Are you from Canada? Is he your sister? Is he your sister? So like, no, he's my brother, you say. Okay, is she your friend, right? You can create sentences and give them as examples for the next class. Seven or eight examples of questions in the yes, no form, okay? That is going to be for Monday's class. Thank you very much for being here. Thank you for your time. And it was a pleasure for me to serve you once again. Don't forget the homework and I'm going to see you on Monday for another class. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Good night. Good night, teacher. Thank you. Work on the platform. Bye-bye. No se les olvide la plataforma. Bye-bye. Take care. Take care. Bye-bye.